Angry Birds Space. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Gordon Burns and we are playing Angry Birds Space Edition on the GCB Gaming Channel. As I'm sure you're all aware, this game is... Let me just turn my audio down. Oh. There we go, that's much better, I can hear myself now. As you can see, this game is, is uh, a load of birds and you have to throw them at some pigs for some reason. I know the birds are very, very angry. Um, I don't actually know why. There must be a backstory to it. I'm gonna presume that they stole the princess and she's in another castle. I have already played through the game. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I've already played through uh, the first ten levels, uh, mostly because I actually recorded a playthrough and I forgot to check the batteries on my microphone. So, sorry. So we're going through it again! Yay! Okay, straight on to level one. The premise is the same as any Angry Birds game where you have to... <laughs> oh yeah! Launch a very angry bird of a certain colour at a sleeping pig! Awesome. And I beat my high score. That little gold egg means that I whooped my last playthrough. So it's worth doing it again and let's go for it now the 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 actual user experience using the controls and stuff <laughs> fail oh terrible i'm sorry the actual user experience is, is a bit different playing this on on a mac because you're using the little trackpad to control your your motion and your velocity and your angle and stuff and it's a bit different than pointing and clicking or using the iPhone or the Android system, which this game is also available on. Uh, and I'll be honest, I was actually surprised how cheap it was to get it on the Mac. It was three pounds, which I thought was pretty good. I was most pleased with that. Now, most of these levels do give you some sort of clue as to what to do. If you look behind the bush, you'll see a little arrow pointing in the right direction. Now I'm hoping that I've got enough momentum boo, to kill him. Sorry, little birdie. Not a new high score, though. That's a shame. That's a shame. Uh, graphics on this are really cool. I like it. I like the... Uh, I mean, it's the same style as the previous version. I'm sorry, I should really explore the map a bit more with you guys. Uh, it's just that because I've played these levels. Oh no, did I not? Ah, fail! Absolute fail. Okay, let's give that another go. Boom! Yeah. Obviously, we're inside the planet atmosphere, so the gravitational pull is affecting us here. Uh, I have noticed that these birds, they don't have spacesuits on or anything. And see, look, my previous best, three stars. So I don't know how they're breathing in space, but uh, never mind. Let's just give this a little scroll. Oh, fail. There we go. So you've got to use the whole trackpad from corner to corner to get the most out of this. But And let's try again. So we're going to go loop, and then down, and then boom. Yeah. Awesome. It's a good shot. Good shot. Apart from the fact I didn't destroy any of the wood. See, the idea is if you destroy the infrastructure and, um, you know, blocks and bits of wood and houses and buildings and stuff like that, it, it increases your score. Uh, so that's always, obviously, the, the goal of the game is to kill the pigs or squish the pigs or whatever happens to the pigs when they explode. And uh, But also, if you destroy more blocks, you get more points. So there's more chance of getting your three stars that way. Um, the rest of the playthrough, after I've done these first ten levels, I... Oh, let's go. Get that. I will be playing for levels, not just for um, for three stars. If I get three stars, it's going to be great, and I'll be aiming for three stars, but I'm just going to complete the levels and then move on to the next level. Otherwise, we'll just repeat levels over and over and over again, and it will get very boring. And here, I'm going to whoop another high score. Yes! New high score. Doing quite well. Doing quite well so far. This level, actually, uh, I got the first time around straight away with one bird. And then, let's see if I can do it again. Oh no. Come on, come on. No. Oh. Let's take it around this way this time. 
Don't tell me. Oh, no. That pig is like... He he deserves a medal. Indestructible piggy wig. Uh, see if that's going to work. Oh, I'm in orbit. Yes. Wow. That was an absolute fail, and I... I hang my head in shame and cry a little bit. Level failed. <sighs> but I have gone through onto the next level anyway because I've already completed it once, so it doesn't matter. Ah, <laughs> oh, again, this is another one of those levels that the first time round I got straight away. Even this time round, yes. Two times. Uh, it's okay, I suppose. I'm gonna have a sip of my coffee. One second. So it's like when you revisit. Did I get three stars? Yeah, I did. Got three stars the first time. When you revisit a game, you you kind of lose your beginner's luck as such. Um, now let's stop it. Let's let go of him. Now let's explore the map because what we have here we have two pigs in orbit. And then I do kind of remember seeing that there was a gold egg on this one last time I played through, and I don't know why I can't see it now. Last time I'm sure I saw a golden egg. And everyone falls to the ground. Oh yeah! That's a new high school for me. Brilliant, brilliant. I do like those birds. They're, they're kind of like a replacement to the uh, the little yellow ones that we had. And let's go on to the next level. This is a cool one. Um, I wonder if we will get those yellow birds back as well, or if these are a total replacement. But let's shoot that out and boom! Into orbit. Yes! In one go! This is going to be better than my last high score. Obviously, again, guys, uh, I've played these levels once already, so that's why I'm doing so well. Apart from that last one that I failed, I should be on. Next one! Okay, we are now on episode 11. So, I haven't actually played this one. I've, I've seen the map, I've got an idea of what to do, but I'm going to leave this till the next game. So, thank you all very much for joining me. Click the annotation in the top right to carry on with the game as intended. I'll be doing a blind playthrough, so I haven't played any of these games. I haven't watched anyone else play them. I'm just going to play straight through them from beginning to end, record it all, and you guys can laugh at me failing. Please leave your scores of the levels that you've played in the comments below, and I will see you all next time. Bye! Subscribe!